Who? Oh, Max. Max oh, Mukati. Max. You love. They shot Max, and now he was in his car, right? On the phone. Mm. And they shot him, but fortunately he didn't die. And he, he drove managed himself. to make yeah. it to the hospital. Wow. And later on, when they picked his phone up, the bullet, bullet. was stuck in the phone. They were literally went for the headshot. Bullet stuck in the phone. Saved by the iPhone Pro mm. Max. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, dog. But I think, for real. But fortunately, he's still alive. Yo, guys, I swear, my son thinks we live in America, bro. For real? Yeah, Why? can you not? What? Because I get he watches like YouTube kids. Yeah. Oh, yeah. He watches all these American YouTubers. Yes. Uh -huh. So he will randomly ask me like, Dad, can I have tacos? Oh. <laughs> Where's the ketchup? <laughs> <laughs> uh, can I have some burritos? <laughs> <laughs> the other day, he's like, can you give me a quarter? <laughs> a quarter. And, and you're like, I'm not a quarter in Midwest. <laughs> yeah. Right? Jeez. That's <laughs> crazy, man. They're influenced by all these American YouTubers, man. Well, of course, if that's all he consumes, that's all he knows. And it's not like they've got the childhood that, well, I had where you go out and you push tires, you make wire cars and you interact and with you push everyday bricks. South Africans. Yeah, you know? a brick is a taxi, right? Y yes, you push a brick. It's a car. It's a car. And then you take, you play marbles, you put uh -huh. two bricks one, with a passage and one on top of both, you know? That sounds like Squid that. Game. <laughs> <laughs> those fossil games. Yeah. yeah. We played those growing up. So, of course, it's all he consumes, bro. I'm waiting for him to grow up and realize that he can get shot in America for buying a burrito. Because <laughs> <laughs> yeah. he doesn't know that now. Please, just protect him for as long as you can. What does your kid watch? Well, also, YouTube and a lot of, like, he's obsessed with, the thing is with my son, he's obsessed with something and he watches the same thing again and again. So I know he's watching um, Supersonic. Mm. There's a movie on Netflix. He watched that. There is uh, Mama Duke. Mm. There is Benji. There's just those movies that he's obsessed with. And you, what's your daughter watching? My daughter, well, she, she's always on YouTube. YouTube and TikTok. Mm. Generally, she's TikTok. always on those. Yeah, she like does her own that she can she scrolls up, scrolls up. You did grab the phone from her, she will lash out at you. Wow. She ain't gonna temper that one. Yeah. I don't know where she gets it from Because I, I, not me You know what I mean Yeah but she's always on TikTok And YouTube mostly Bro but these YouTube kids Are making money yo. Yes yo. You're the richest Yo, 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 yo. they get million views My son likes Ryan's World yo. Yeah. Yo, 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 yo. What does Ryan's World do now? Like it's a, one of these Kitty's things, kiddies things okay, right? Okay. But listen to this bro his net worth, this is the kid. His uh -huh. net worth is estimated to be $32 million. Oh, wow. Started the channel in 2015, by the way. Ooh. And since he started the channel, his parents quit their jobs uh -huh. and they just focus on the channel. <gasps> this guy has 30 million subscribers. Thank you. With over 48 billion views. When he, loads the, when he uploads an episode, he gets about a million views in a day. Mm hmm <laughs> I know with these YouTube kids, it's and it crazy. supports his parents literally. Yeah. yeah, Jesus. But we need our own YouTube kids, like a South African version. Yes, nah. there's nothing like that out there. But it's Actually, coming. That's a good idea. It's a matter yeah. of time, though. Nah. It's, co it's coming. It's a matter of time, bro. Yeah. I mean, who thought podcasting? You know what I mean? Would take off. It's sort of taking off. It's coming. It's gonna happen. Your kid is consuming. Our kids are gonna do it. Yeah, I think I'm gonna get my kid on this, man. Hmm? Maybe quit the podcast. Like, yeah. It's too much. You <laughs> <laughs> can retire. <laughs> I know the Don't say works, that. They want to say it's Channel O money. <laughs> it's making you talk reckless. <laughs> you know. <laughs> I'm on the Channel O. Gosh. Anyway, end of it. Did you see how the boys were not interested because we're talking about kids? <laughs> They're all on their phones. <laughs> I'm glad. I'm glad. I'm glad. Not, at least we won't get a case, right? Anytime soon. I'm glad. And now, but I mean, ladies and gentlemen, we are back. Back and back.
sitting on 300,000 views. No, subscribers. 300,000 views. 300,000 subscribers. Oh, there's 1,300 subscribers. 300,000 views. Yeah, man. Close to that, dog. We hit 300,000, bro. Ah, oh, shout out, man. I remember we did a party for 1,000 subscribers. I remember. Day. Celebrate all your wins, bro. Exactly. Not, nothing wrong with that, but yeah. yeah. You're going to laugh one day that we celebrated 300,000. Yeah. Where do you guys want to start, man? I think there's only one place we can start. <laughs> yeah? Bonang, the Bonang Saga. Bonang, Bonang Gates. Bonang. What is happening? You yeah. Yeah. Remember how we said that she doesn't own like PNG? We've wow. been saying that. We've been saying that. Mm -hmm. Now it's officially out. Mm. So basically the guys that she was working with, like CSA Global, has allegedly negotiated directly with House of BNG, winemaking partners Vino Ventures, and has split the partnership between the cutting between them, cutting Bonang out as a stakeholder. A oh, those are even. snake moves though. That's messed up. Now it it takes me to a point and what is Bonang doing in the States? Isn't this a sign maybe just come back and just take care of your business this side? But I told you, she goes to the park. Ah. <sighs> Central Park. But it's cold now. It's very cold. It's I think it's 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 like snowing that side in the States, eh? And you know it's tricky. If you go well, to uh, if you York. go to America, right? Try yeah. to make it. Yeah. And you don't make it. Mm -hmm. you, you, do you come back? You come back. Ah, bro, everyone's going to laugh at you, bro. How, how can I be laughed at a person who's living with their mom when you're Bonang, you've got a mansion and a few properties and you've made it? I don't get that. How, how, how dare you even laugh the gumption and the audacity to laugh at Bonang? When you're still trying to figure your life out. Mm. You can't laugh at them. Nice to see or Bonang or anyone for trying, dog. You can't. Mm. These are people who've established themselves locally, made millions, and you're going to laugh because they try to do something? That's the mentality we need to get rid of. Mm. And, and screw CSA, man. How do you go behind the person who is the face and who is the reason that this particular brand is selling? And screw the PNG makers as well for actually, it's like me going behind MacGyver's back and, and say, let's start our own podcast, whatever, 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 whatever. And you yeah. doesn't see it coming. You know yeah. what I mean? Yeah. When, when the shit is popping because of him, mainly, right? And he's the goose that laid the golden egg. That's fucked up. No, no, that's true. But weren't there other things that Monang was lacking on? Now, other businesses that caused all of this to happen? So in her story? absentia, yeah, because that's what it just uh, looks like. Allegedly, in her moving away, there were so many things now that were not taken care of. And how was she making money from BNG? Was she getting paid in royalties or what? Royalties. royalties. She yeah, gets something royalties. per bottle. Yeah, per, per bottle. bottle. Yeah, that is yeah so like royalties, royalties yes. essentially. Yeah, mm. she gets a percentage. But I did see that she doesn't um, face or carry the same risk. When it comes to losses and also thing. capitalizing. Yes. yes. But still though, I mean, she's a marketer. She's, it's like what Diddy does. Diddy does not own Ciroc. And people were fighting with me when I said that. He does not. He's a marketing person who markets it. And also with him, you know, there's a deal in place. And maybe she's, well, maybe Diddy still puts in the work. I don't know with Bonang, whatever the contract like expects what the expectation is in her contract with this whole PNG thing. Yes. So maybe those are the things where because of she's away, there were some things that she was obligated to do that she was not meeting. So she, so what you're saying is she's possibly in breach of contract. Yes. Because in a contract you have obligations, I have obligations. Yes. If I don't fulfill mine, such as if it's at work, you don't come on time mm -hmm. for a week, nah, I don't you think can it's get that, fired. I think it's the beef is between CSA and her and then PNG just happens to be collateral damage. Because uh, if you check, this thing started with her doing the space which crashed, right? Mm -hmm. Oh, I remember. And she was distancing herself from CSA. Mm. CSA, whatever it's called. Yes. Because I'm sure she could tell that shit is about to hit the fan. Yes. So let me get on in front of this before, you know, so I can save face. Mm. Okay. She knew what was coming. Yes. So she got backstabbed, essentially. I think so. Yeah, it sounds like typical backstabbing. Like, because okay. these agencies come to you. So if you are under CSA, right? Mm. They come to you. They're like, Amstel wants to do one, two, three. Mm -hmm. And then you choose. Yeah. So they lay the foundation, do all the hard work, all the admin, negotiate. That's what they pay to do. Of right? course, yeah. yeah. Yes. So if they come to you and say, okay, uh, Amstel wants you to be an ambassador, mm. then you say, okay, cool, I'll do it. And then you check the contract, you sign, mm. boom. So I don't think she had any say. Well, obviously she did. Like if she didn't like some things in the agreement, then she let her people know and then they negotiate with Amstel and whatever the case may be. But I don't think she actually went out to get the contract herself. Mm, no, I think no. CSA went out to do no, the no, bidding yes, for her. Yes. Oh. Yeah. 
are. But still, it's 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 messed up for them to 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 cut it out like that. And now, because it's gonna backfire, people. But the beehive will stop buying the BNG, right? And this is what now why Twitter was just up in arms is that literally people are saying if there's no Bonang, we're not buying BNG. And that's the right way to go. And I feel the same about as well. It. Yeah, because yeah, I love Yeah, Cruz lost uh, 40 percent in, uh, in sales. Yeah, exactly. Since they dropped they, AKA. They dropped AKA, yeah. right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly, and uh, they deserve it. Yeah. But my thing is, bro, so as a celebrity, why BNG are you can still me. being an ambassador for a brand? Surely, if Willis comes to you, right? And they say we want you to be the face of BNG. Mm-hmm. Surely should click like, wow, I'm so influential that I can get this moving. So no, why not create your own BNG? Who? Where is you gonna get a, a vineyard and the grapes and the means of production to make wine, bro? Bro, she's what now? Nah, she's got connections for days. Are but you telling these me? These are the connections. Woolies is the connection. No, this is the easy way out. But look, look, just close by to you. MacGyver has gin. How did yeah, he start it's it? It's easier to gin. The means of production for gin versus wine, guys. Wine. Wine. But, Have you seen you those got, wine estates in Cape Town and yeah. all those grapes? Bro, we've got, we've got Suela wines with exactly. 0% of, of the connections that she has. That Who's Suela wines? Thank you. So there Google is. Suela wines. Google Suela wines. Before you... No. <laughs> Suela. <laughs> Are we in a well? Uh? <laughs> Are we twins? Suela, 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 Suela wines. Yeah. No, the problem is these Black celebs always wine. choose shortcuts. They never think about the long term. But look, she did make quite a decent bag from these shortcuts. Yeah. She's made a couple of Listen, I'm hoping many millions. There's nothing wrong with taking shortcuts, right? Yeah. And 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 getting money like while you're popping, right? Yeah. But I'm thinking, if you're a celebrity, okay, what's the long term vision? Because everything looks short term. Do you understand what I'm saying? Yeah, I get it. Because that's why I started Grandeur. Because I'm like, no matter what happens, whether YouTube decides one day, hey, they don't want this podcast anymore and we don't have a platform. You've got something, right? Yeah. To sell. Yeah. yeah. Or even yeah, if yeah. I get cancelled. I remember when I was getting cancelled, they were saying, let's tag Grandeur Jin <laughs> <laughs> and get him fired. <laughs> and they were taking you. <laughs> <laughs> Idiots. <laughs> Didn't you distance yourself from your own yeah, gym? I I, that white bottle yeah. left on the show. <laughs> Who we must tell those people to distance themselves <laughs> from the That's when you saw people are so bitter. Yeah. You know what I mean? <laughs> and for me, Grandeur is a long term thing. Like yeah. I haven't made I haven't made a single cent from Grandeur. A yeah. single cent. Yeah. Like all the money we make, we put back into the you company. Because mm. it's, it's a long term thing. Because yes. I'm thinking, you know. With this industry, nothing is is is, is confirmed. Nothing guaranteed. is guaranteed. It's guaranteed. Tomorrow is, is is not guaranteed. You understand? Yeah. You know. So that's why I never understand celebs who'd wanna be an ambassador of something of something instead of just owning it, which is what I think uh, the the house DJs do really really well, because not only do they DJ, they also have like restaurants. Some are into trucking okay. property. Okay. Yes, yes. Do you get what I'm saying? Yes. 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 Because yes. nothing's guaranteed. <laughs> True. But look, bro, at the same time, you can't tell kids to say no to bags. Yes, it's a shortcut, but it's an easy bag, right? It is, it is. And we can't be sitting here in a country which has got so much poverty and unemployment and say it's, guys, say no to... Okay, do you think that's sustainable? It's not sustainable, it's not. but the 10 million rands that she's walking away with or more can sustain her and also what if her thinking was she's raising capital to do something of her own so would you rather make 10 million for one year or 10 million for 10 years i'd rather make 10 million for one year and then after that year i've got capital to start something which will make me 10 million in 10 years okay Mm. Uh, but why couldn't you just said all right with this instead of just getting 10 million let me get a shares Yes, what's it? Okay, yes. Yeah. yes. Let me get, get stock. shares. Get yeah. stock. Yeah. stock. Right? Yes, that, you see now, that, if you get stock. So even if you end up with fine. a million every year, it's fine, but you know you are guaranteed a million, two million, five million every year until equity. you die. Mm. And you can li- leave it with you too for your children's children. Exactly. I don't think, guys, one thing I don't think is, is dumb, right? And has got some dumb people in her corner. I'm pretty sure she's got some smart lawyers. And that's how she's managed to maneuver But with how things game. are panning up. They probably tried mm, to mm. say, no, we want stock. No, we wouldn't want to be. That's why she's got royalties, right? At least. Guys, it's not what Bonang did. Let's not try to convince ourselves that it was a bad, it was bad for business. It was, she's made a killing from it. 
It sucks that they had to do this to her. Yeah. And you're right. When you get deals like these, that's what happens. But it was not a, a horrible deal. It's not, but it's yeah. short-sighted. That's what I'm saying. It's short-sighted, bro. Because, like, there's so many factors that come into play when you don't own anything. But we don't know the contract, though, MacGyver. What do you mean? They just said she owns royalties. Yes, but I'm just saying maybe these royalties will come in when every time a bottle is sold, even if it's no longer, she's no longer part of it. But no, it's, no, it's, no, it's, no, maybe no. it's lifetime loyalty. Then they haven't cut her out. Then they haven't cut her out. That's because equity. they're taking a PNG, unless they change the name and like she's now out. Totally. Then it's not PNG anymore. Yeah. Because she's people, but she if doesn't it's own still the name. PNG going she forward. Own the name. No, she doesn't own anything. Damn. Shh. So they can just replace her with Mini Jamini. And then the people's responsibility is stop buying uh, the brand. If, the, if brands are going to do that to black kids, so then you stop MG. supporting the brand. Because they, it, dude, it's the, the, the stands and people who are familiar with Bonang who buy this thing. No, That's, but dog, it's not up to those people. Those people are just trying to make business decisions and make money, right? Which people? It, uh, the, the ones that get uh, uh, these celebrities to be faces. It's up to the celebrities to start making their own brands so we support their brands. That is beautiful. Yes. True. Not trying to look for a shortcut and get a three million deal for now. You so said the entertainment game is, is, is unpredictable. 100%. So why would you leave three million bucks in a game that is unpredictable? Mm hmm. Man, he's Mac, killing me today. I get you. No, no, no. He's killing me. Eh? Yeah, like I get you. Bro. I get you. I love what you're trying to do. I love what you're trying to. What you're saying. Just it's, keep it's on amazing. making it. You know. Let's build stuff that when we something happens to us, we can leave for our kids, mm. right? Because an endorsement deal, you can't leave for your kids. Yes. Mm. But if an endorsement deal and it's got a good bag, take it. You will learn and build something of your own at a later stage with that very same money. Like, where did you get the capital to, to start Grandeur? Fuck, man. I had to borrow 100000 from Coach Leo. Thank you. Fuck, I still owe him, man. You just reminded me. For real. <laughs> I still owe Make Coach Leo. E EFT there. You <laughs> can't owe money. <laughs> Make it EFT there, bro. You know what I mean? Yeah. But, like, you didn't have capital. And yeah. these are also just kids who are hot in the right space do take the endorsement deals but also think long term and start your own things as you do that because what that does it affords you uh, the, 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 um, the time to, to get to know the workings of the industry now Bonang knows the workings of the wine industry she's in the perfect place to start her own thing now thanks to being the face of it, because you eventually, if you're the face of Amstel, you eventually get to go to the distillery, get to know what happens, and you're in a better position. No, you don't. You just post whenever they ask you to post. But if you want to learn, if you're smart enough to learn, you will mm. say, take me to the distillery. Mm. Take me to this. Who does this? Who does that? In case shit hits the fan, then you know you can come back and create your own beer with the very same money you got from the endorsement. I'm too sober for this conversation, man. You're killing me. Oh. I'm, ca I'm <laughs> murdering you, <here>, man. I'm <laughs> killing you, bro. Okay. Hey, hey, raise your hands if you agree with Saul. Raise your hands if you agree with me. Oh, no hands. Oh. What's going on? What the fuck is happening? What the fuck is happening? Yeah, they're not listening. Okay, say yeah if you agree with Saul. Yeah. Say yeah if you agree with me. Yeah. Ah. <laughs> it's fine. Chillers will, chillers, chillers will, 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 you know. Well, yeah, yeah, neighbors. I agree with everything you're saying, but I'm yeah. saying it is silly. To tell you know what you say, yeah. It's like that whole thing of 500k versus dinner with Jay Z, and you're telling him, have dinner with Jay Z because it's gonna impart and the knowledge that you can use forever. Come on, dog, take the money. Yeah. I can never discourage people not to take good money. Mm. I would say don't take bad deals if you're gonna make you a face of something and they're gonna pay you peanuts, right? But if they're gonna give you good money for your name. Go ahead. Yes, yeah, yo, dude, take it's like the Boyd deal. Team. It's not a shortcut. We don't know Boyd is a deal. circumcised midget. She's a face. They're all faces. Yeah, no, we know, but we just we don't know her deal as well. So in the long run, something may happen, and she loses. Well, it's not hers. I think. Well, but Boyd is in the in the, in the CIPC. I went to CIPC and I. Oh, is it? Yeah, she's. Oh, dope. There's some guy who's using a passport. I think the name sounds French. There's a couple of white guys, and her name is there as well. Tulo, we do oh, Yeah. Her name is there. Um, in, 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 as a director who owns the company that makes these things. Uh, I was actually listening to a space. Fuck, I love spaces. I'm so happy. Oh. Eh? Oh, the Noto one. The Noto one. Oh, that Noto space. <laughs> <laughs> and I was that lit, space. bro. <laughs> what happened in that space, dog? Hey, bro, it started off because I caught it like in the middle, but yeah. it started off with drip. Something about drip and how they 
they, I don't know, something about drip. Oh yeah, drip. That loan shock situation they had yeah. there when the guy needed money at first, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay. And I think I actually met that guy because when I was starting Grand Jew, I needed some capital, and we had just did a Black Friday with Lakao from Drip. Mm. So I was like, "Yo, bro, do you know anyone who might want to invest in Grand Jew?" Mm. So we went to Recharge and we had a meeting with this guy, and this guy was like, "Yo, Mashia." I don't know who the guy. Yeah, yeah, I forgot. It's, it's Alfred Mashia. Yeah. Oh. yeah, I think it was him. I could be wrong. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But he was like, "Yeah, he helped Drip," you know. Yeah, uh, with funding them. Okay. So you can do the same for Granger. Okay. And then the the deal just didn't materialize. But I think it's the same guy. Glad it did. You dodged the bullet. Bro. Yeah. 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 That guy, I mean, borrowed the guy like 50k. Yo. And then the guy ended up paying this guy half a million rand. For oh, real. Yeah. yeah. And then the guy and the payments were late because of COVID. He didn't do that uh, business look out, but eventually paid him. But now the guy was like every month or day that you don't pay me, it accumulates by this much, by that much. And now, now this guy wants 34% of Lukao's business. Oh. What does he think he is? Mm. Yeah. So then they went into Bonang okay. about how she doesn't own the the the, the, the BNG brand. Mm. Well, this is notes. It was actually <laughs> a monologue. Everybody was just listening to notes. He's the authority. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I was like, literally, Nota has found his space now. Because <laughs> he loved the sound of his own voice. <laughs> and he wouldn't let anyone talk, dog. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, but I love it, dog. I was like, fuck, this is what radio is supposed to be like, bro. Yeah. It reminds me of, like talk radio, but like people are talking about stuff that's real, r- stuff, real stuff. That we care about. Yeah, right? yeah. And then they started speaking about Bonang. But what he mentioned with was, which was very interesting, he said that there's a law that's coming into play now. I'm paraphrasing. I could be wrong. Yeah. Where they're going to ban like alcohol advertising. So they're going to be strict on alcohol advertising. So these alcohol brands are trying to bypass that by getting celebs to be the brand ambassadors. Because then they can still push the product. Ah, yeah. Without any limitations. Yes. Yeah, yeah. That's what I think he said. But yeah. Ah, interesting. Yeah. Nice. Future ahead. Which other spaces have you listened to? Okay, I listened to a depressing space this morning, but I haven't listened to... Let me Which try. one? Which one? No, 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 no. It's depressing, bro. It's like girls sharing the experiences of GBV. It was like... Ooh. Ooh. I, I had to turn it off. Like, it was so, you know, getting to me. And I was with my daughter, you know what I mean? So, yeah, it was triggering, like, you know? Mm. Um, but, yeah, I haven't checked out a lot of space. Oh, I, I missed Shims' space. Oh, Did yeah, you catch yeah. that? No, no, I didn't catch that. Either. Oh, flip. But apparently that fell flat, like it failed. Because yeah. he was coming out to explain some stuff, but he couldn't talk his lawyer. I mean, he, he brought a lawyer to his space. You know, he, he lawyered up and the lawyer was like, no, you can't answer that. You can't answer that. So that was a waste of time. Do you know that's Malachi lawyer? Do you know him? The? Malachi, his name is Malachi. K Malachi, he's the guy who started Homecoming. Oh, for real? Yeah, Homecoming in Pretoria. Yeah, yeah. he used to be a promoter. He's a, oh. he's a lawyer by profession, but a promoter as well. Is he a big deal? I think he's... Big yeah. deal in Pretoria. Also helped, I think, I may be wrong, but helped uh, 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 launch Focalistic or like mm. propel him, rather, propel him. You know what I mean? Into the Focal that he is today. Package him nicely and stuff, yeah. But he's, he's a bit of a big deal and he's got a job at Sony. But he never liked me much. I've seen him tweet shit about me. What's he saying about I don't you? know, like... When I was on radio, when I went to a new station, like I don't like the salt and do a guy, whatever, whatever. I don't, I don't know what the fuck. But who the fuck can not like you, bro? Ah, some people. I was like, ah, whatever. Yeah, but I know him. It's yeah. a bit of a big deal. Uh, but I see he served Nota, I think, with with papers and pa- Nota's trying to get him fired. Damn. And Nota's retaliating. Nota will never take it <gasps> lying down. Yo. Nota is a fighter. Yo. Nota fights, bro. Hey, Nota, like, <laughs> hey, 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 hey. <laughs> the guy is just doing push-ups every day, like, <laughs> yeah, on top so of his phone, that. like, just watching, like, who's next? Anyway, did you guys see Big Brother's back? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Big Brother is back. And please, people. So you should be the face of Big Brother, huh? Oh, oh, yeah. I mean, oh, exactly. that bag. <laughs> Make a look, no, start your own big brother. <laughs> you, you are big. You're a brother. Start your own. <laughs> and you've you got see. the voice. And yeah. you've got the voice. <laughs> start your own. Oh, Yo, you've got a YouTube channel. Utilize it. You can be on the you have Big Brother streaming 24-7 from David Machabella's 13th house that he's last slept in five years ago. <laughs> you said this is doable. That's a great idea. <laughs> yeah, yeah, actually, that would be a fucking cool big brother, though, eh? <laughs> Hey, man. What you doing in the loo, man? Hey, man. Hey, man. Come hey, on, man. dog. There's so many honeys in this house. You're pleasuring yourself. 
Hey man, come to Big Brother's room. Get proper lotion. We've got lube. Get lube. Stop wasting the lotion. <laughs> Next, next contestant comes in, grabs a face lotion. I'm like, hey, man, do you really want to apply that on your face? <laughs> do you know who just used it? You me? know where that was. <laughs> <laughs> your face smells like testes now. <laughs> hey, man. Actually, we must start our own big yeah, brother. Bro. Let's, let's, bro. Let's, bro. <laughs> You can do but this. people have been asking me, like, guys, I don't know anything. I'm just like you. I'm I'm just seeing I was on Big Brother one season. I didn't even win. I don't know where the auditions are. I don't know when the auditions are. Someone wanted to invite me to a space to say the do's and don'ts <laughs> of the auditions. Just be yourself. Get there. I auditioned three times. Yeah. Mm. Big Brother Africa, I remember auditioned at the Wanderers. Then I auditioned at Newtown at the base. Moonchild was when there. When you audition, have I asked you this before? When you audition, what happens? Yeah, yeah. So, you get there. I remember the one in at, at the Wanderers was Big Brother Africa. You got there, they asked you a couple of questions. Also asked you, what would you never do, right? And oh. I gave a stupid answer. And then they gave, then in that one. What answer did the, you give? A stupid answer. What did you say? Eh? What did you say? It was a stupid answer. <laughs> <laughs> we don't want the LGBTQI people to come up. Oh. It was a stupid answer. Oh. Of what I wouldn't be willing to do. Oh. Oh. Okay. Hey, man. I hey get you, man. man. Hey, hey. Man. No, no, not a man. <laughs> 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 hint, hint. <laughs> so yeah, they gave us a bag with props, and they're like, "Improvise, keep us entertained for two minutes." Okay, you know what I mean. So I, I don't know what I did. There was like a ra random things I can't remember. So that's practically they give you a situation. They will ask about you to get a couple of like your personality traits, uh, 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 you know what you're about, and then. To see if you can think on on the spot, so people must realize. Oh, you nailed that! I'm sure. Ne? Oh no, no, oh, nailed oh. it, nailed it. So people must realize there's nothing wrong with you, dude. Moonchild mm. auditioned mm. at the one in in in, in Newtown. Sure. Ne? Guess who auditioned for Big Brother Mzans and didn't make it? Mm. To some bedu. To some oh. bedu. To some bedu was in the queue. I remember. <sighs> I got this guy um, who I knew introduced me to and was like, this is a girl I'm with. I'm like, who? Hot girl. You know what I mean? Yeah. And then a few years later, it's like, dude, remember that girl auditions? I'm like, yeah. I got to some baby. I'm like, fuck for real? Like, yeah. She auditioned. You know what she so can not, buy not, Big Brother now. Eh? She can buy it. She can buy Big Brother. Yeah, oh, definitely. You know, so it, nothing wrong with you if you don't make it. Thing is, they're looking for a certain group of people and a certain mix. So maybe already they've spotted a soul. Mm -hmm. So if they see another soul... It doesn't mean there's something wrong with you. Maybe they've already spotted. Or What's a soul? Like, uh, like my kind of person. Like maybe a loud, energetic person, oh. smart guy. You know mm. what I mean? Smarty pants in the house. <laughs> you know, with all the jokes, smart okay. jokes, <laughs> shitting on stupid old people. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like then, uh, nothing wrong if you don't make it, mm. right? So I made it after three auditions because now maybe they're like, oh, he's, he would be good for this group that we need. So yeah, just be yourself. Mm. You'll, so you'll basically, these were callbacks mm? that you kept on going to. Call yeah, backs. then they call you back. Okay. What did they call us back? Yeah, they they, they shortlist you, call you back like twice, three times, and then they. they How they, much they, of Big Brother is staged? Nothing. Nothing. Nothing is staged. Nothing. Nothing. They don't pause and say, "Say this, do this, do that." You fuck her. Mm. You know what I mean? No, oh. nothing. Nothing is staged. It's nothing is nice. staged, bro, at all. At all, nothing. And what do you think it takes to win Big Brother? Be yourself. That's it. Be yourself and be smart. Smart. Because and also most importantly, relatable. Mm. You mm. see, like the guy who won our Big Brother, he deserved. Oh manja. yeah, man. Yeah. Yeah. Very relatable. Yes, you know? yes. He's funny, relatable. He's humble, and he got a big dick. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody doesn't love a big dick. The women gush over it. The men are like, yo, respect to you. And he, he fucked. Right? And he smashed like the hottest girl in the house. Yeah, Lexi. Yeah, Lexi. yeah, like top three hottest girls. Did they girls. smash? They yeah. smashed in the shower. Like, Ooh. full view. Wow. Full view of everyone. Damn it. Exactly. Dog. You know what I mean? So, I mean, he had everything going for him. You know, so just be yourself, bro. 
but don't be a dick. Like I've never seen a dick, dick a person who's a dick. I think yeah. a lot of the guys. I mean, I remember the first season I watched of Big Brother Africa. Keegan won, very humble uh, guy from Cape Town. You know, all the winners generally are down to earth, relatable people. You can be whoever you are, but just be relatable and be real. Yeah, that's it. Bro. Just have to be a common guy, common person, or woman. You know. Yeah, you can be larger than life, but also you know. Bring it down a bit, you know, especially when you've got a, a, a diary session with Big Brother because now that's literally just you and the viewers. Yeah. It's not you and Big Brother. It's you and the viewers. Would you that's do it, Ghost you Lady? Them over. Big Brother? Yeah. Before I would, not now. Before? Yeah. Why? Well, what happened? She's uh, married now. Not even about just Wife. being married. Like, uh, go and waste three months and leave my son. Ah, uh, nah, guys. No. Oh, oh, yes. Before your you son. See. Yes. Yeah, before if I've got, you know, just got nothing to take care of ah, now you're just fine. busy trying to give him a big brother <laughs> <laughs> no make him a big brother yeah yeah oh, oh yeah, actually, yeah. Him. <laughs> I think you, you saved it <laughs> oh man i saw this funny thing on tiktok right yeah it was a screen grab listen to this bro okay. i think it was from facebook yeah but it goes hello auntie momoza mm -hmm. please keep me anonymous mm -hmm. i need to ask help for my cousins Mm -hmm. hmm. Bear in mind cousins, you okay. Doesn't Corobella expire when a person dies? I gave my husband <laughs> Corobella and it worked in my favor for years. Ooh. He is dead now, but he visits me every night. He doesn't touch me or do anything. He sits and watches me until 4 a.m. <laughs> <laughs> and then disappears. <laughs> I have tried prophets, sangomas, and prayer. Nothing has helped. Please help me get rid of him. I'm willing to pay. <laughs> 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 Who's, whose name is Momoza? <laughs> Imagine, bro. <laughs> That's a problem. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, ne. <laughs> has, has anyone ever used Corvella on you, bro? No. Yeah. I don't think anyone. Maybe, <laughs> maybe someone did, <laughs> but <laughs> I can't prove it. But I would believe it if they said she'd use Corvella on me. What did you do? But no. What did you do that was like? I just couldn't get over her for like the longest time. Mm. For like the longest. Oh. What's the longest, longest time? Time frame? Like. Six years. Yo! Till now! Long, till ah. now, not till now. I <laughs> <laughs> was, wasn't sure. She comes in your dreams every morning. And, and, hey, and Joel, she I'm like, hey, Coromel. <laughs> just because I gave you Coromel and now you're here again. <laughs> Leave me alone. No, man. Uh, but yeah, look. No, I, six years is a long time, dog. It's a long time, bro. Like, it's the weirdest six thing that has years. ever happened to me. But eventually... I broke free from the chains of um, Corovella. How, how, how did you break free? I don't know. Yeah. It just happened. It just happened. So oh. in those six years when you smashed another girl, you'd still think about her? Mm. Ah, yeah, it was nothing, bro. It was nothing. Then I'd stalk her a bit. And then when I found out she got a boyfriend, I would only sleep for two days, right? <laughs> Thinking, oh, they're smashing on this side, that side, this angle, that angle. <laughs> hey, it was a night, oh, bro, like, it was, it was bad, you know, yes. it was bad. I remember then texting her, you know, saying, ah, you're dating this guy now, you know. And then her mom called me, like, hey, what the fuck is wrong with you, man, you know. My child came crying. You, you, you know, and it was fucked up of me, you know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, but, but, yeah, I'm cool now. So, you I'm mean the mother had to call you? Yeah, to say, off. hey, man, what? Like, this is the third time this happens. How do you know all her boyfriends every time? The sister called me and be like, you did something to her WhatsApp, didn't you? I'm like, no. I'm like, yeah, you did. You, you know? But I'm over it now. I'm over it now. We Are did. you sure you were the one who's not wasn't using? Eh? You probably were using. Using? <laughs> or Romela on her. No, how? Because she's moved on. Yeah, I me? couldn't move on. So yeah. that's why I'm like, if there's anyone who would have used Corobella on me, it must have been that lady. But otherwise, no. I don't, I don't believe in Corovella. There's such a thing, guys. No, I also don't believe in it. No I, way. I, I believe it. I believe it. Yeah. Ah, but how? haven't you seen? Like, there's some people who would love a person, no matter what they do, they are still to gay. them, cheat, treat them like shit, you know? But isn't that love, Date bro? someone for 10 years and they don't even know your kid's name. Mm. Like, they don't even know both your kid's names. 
They never even ask, how are your kids? Like, what's going on? Are you cool? Are they cool? How's this boy? Oh, it's Christmas here. I've got gifts for them. Oh, it's his birthday today. I remember it. You know mm. what I mean? And you still love this person. He cheats on you literally every time. And then you find yourself dumping them only to be back with them the following day. You know, like Corobella works. You see, Corobella I don't see works. it as Corobella. I always see that as just your own issues, your yeah, own personal issues. Yeah. It like still it's, be it's, it's, you have explained. let some insecurities. It's just something that is, whether it's in your upbringing, like you, you just were unable to see the value in yourself to move on. You right? can't see the value in yourself mm. to. Oh, have you ever used Corobella, Gosling? No, why You've would never. I? Never. Yeah. But you believe in it? No, I don't even believe in it. That's why. Where do you even get it, bro? Ah, ah, bro, you ah, find it with everywhere. They've, they've, got, like, they've posters everywhere now, you know. Like you can go lava. to Faraday, Taxi Rank, <laughs> they've got Muti, There's the potions. Muti section. Mm. I know about it because I went to go buy... Um, mm? <laughs> 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 what's this thing that helps with COVID? Um Konyan. Yes, yes. No, no, not Corabella from Konyan. Um Konyan. I went to go to Um Konyan and I was like, it's a whole... Flea market <laughs> of like moot, you know, like you can ever I'm sure you can get it there. Yeah. yeah. Where's that, bro? Faraday. 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 Faraday the taxi rank. Yeah, I just know Faraday the taxi rank. Yeah, yeah. Faraday, bro. Yeah. Um Faraday is like on the outskirts of Josie before you go to like Oh go my my, I'm sure you get. Go my my you can because yeah. yeah. you can get guys. Corbella like there, bro. Um and uh, in China, but apparently it's like a doughy, pasty thing. That you can easily put in a dumbbell, for example. <laughs> you can in 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 bop, for yeah. example. You know what I mean? Yeah. And yeah. I'm forever eating bop, dog. Yeah. yeah. Then it stays here. And <laughs> <laughs> hey. Yeah, maybe. Has has anyone here been using Corobella? On? Anyone here? Mesh. Mesh. Who's using Corobella? You know. Mesh. They, they use Corobella on you. They put it in your mesh, didn't they? <laughs> 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 That's crazy. Yeah, no, Corabella is real. And also, it, it's happening, like, I've, I've heard stories of, it's very prevalent now amongst young people. Mm. By young, mm. I mean, like, people in the 30s, 35, you know? Even younger, even you'd 20s. be surprised. Yeah, people use Corabella. And that shit is dangerous, bro. That shit is dangerous. That's what I'm saying. Like, see that person? Mm. They deserve that shit. They deserve to be haunted by their person. Because you can't do that to a person, right? Give them free will. If... If Corabella works, you know what I mean? And even if it doesn't work, how dare you try to manipulate someone, someone's love so that you can abuse it, so that you can... Because look, if someone loves you organically, you can maintain that relationship if you love them back and you don't cheat on them, you don't do fucked up shit, you don't do wrong things, right? You can maintain it. So why do you need extra, like, outside help, multi help? So you deserve whatever comes your way for using Corabella on people. Because there's also other people out there who genuinely want to love that person, genuinely, without fucking yeah. using Corabella, and you're taking that chance away from those people and this person you're with. Mm. So I feel strongly about Corabella. Only because I once wanted someone and I think she was given Corabella. <laughs> <laughs> like, Who is this? Ah, someone that they don't deserve a mention. Yeah. Uh. Do you think your woman's using Corabella on you now? No, I don't ne. think so. No, ne. Don't it's think pure so. love, ne. Uh, yeah, it's 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 organic. It's real. Mm. It's it's natural. You know what I mean? Um, you, it's pure love. Hey, I'm starting to have second thoughts. Ah, <laughs> who's <laughs> using you? Why, or her? Now, what's happening now? No, I'm just thinking. Like, if it's real, maybe she's used. I don't know. Cause I love <gasps> her to bits, bro. Mm. I'll do anything for this woman. Ah, yes. uh, but that's good. When she comes in the room, you see. The na lady around. Na lady, na lady, na lady. What about these? Na lady. Nah, but I doubt it, man. She doesn't believe in like moody and stuff like that. Yeah. But you see, that those are the perfect people to use it on you. For real. Yeah. Yo. So it's a front. Yes, like I'm saying, this dude who's using Corabella and this chick, you know what I mean? Like, he's a gym, gym coach or whatever, cyclist, whatever kind of character. And, you know, you would never think. Speaks like Lonnie English, Model C, Nyana. Those are the people you wouldn't think. Because yeah, obviously, I remember when, when we broke up, dog. I, could, I couldn't even get it up for any other girls. I wanted her. <sighs> hey, 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 hey. Hey. When you're like, hey, come, get up. Mm. It was like, <laughs> <laughs> Because of the Corobad. <laughs> eh? <laughs> uh, you can't even like And when she was around You'd go on like a seatbelt You know when you haven't Put on your seatbelt In the car It goes dee, 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 Yeah 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 <laughs> 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 Corobella 
love, man. It's pure love. It's pure love, man. It's pure love. Yeah, yeah, you can't even get it up. <laughs> ah, that's not pure love, bro. You, you're not telling us how or the way how you are crazy for her. You yeah, know? no, I'm crazy. Or how for she's her. also crazy for you. you no, see? I'm crazy for her more. I love her more than she loves me. Oh, that's good. Oh, I believe that, that's yeah. the right yeah. of relationship. That women, no. you, women don't. She loves you more than no you. No way. Bro, I have fucked up, bro. Like from here to beyond. Oh, yes. And to, I've done some but fucked then up how shit. You, that's why if she did the things that you did, would you have forgiven her like she did? No. Then she loves you more than you love her. <gasps> oh, okay. Yeah, you're right. Oh. You're right yeah. You see, I believe the other way. A man must love you more. A man, than a woman. thank you. That, no, no. Initially, then a man must love you. Mm-hmm. Women grow to love, bro. Yeah. Women grow. I know about taking my type, wash our cream, wash but women grow to love. That's why you treat her like a queen. Yeah. And she'll build your castle. She'll treat you like a king. Because mm. they grow to love. You're right though. Initially the man needs to be more in love. That's yes, what I believe as I well. Believe too, with though. the woman. Yeah. I'm not gonna way in, way in. <laughs> and that's beautiful. <laughs> Wait, 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 I'm the only girl out of a room of like 10 men, but I, I the You know, you can't even say to him, let's go to the strip club. He's going to say, okay, let me call my wife first. <laughs> That's beautiful. That is beautiful. That's must beautiful. Be deep. I'm not going to let's buy. Okay, let me call my wife first. <laughs> Baby, my phone was taken. <laughs> I'm going on. I'm a top. <laughs> But we've got like a squash of fridge in the gym. Ah, baby, I'm not going to be able to Why do you sound like him? Huh? Yeah, that's his voice right there. No, what do you think I... about Millie Zamini's nude? Ah, oh, she dropped nudes? Is that even a nude? Ghost show lady. me. Show me that. I, I didn't see it. Let me see the picture. Where's my phone? My phone's yeah, off, what? man. Let me show you. Show so, show so. Let me show you. Is that even classified as a nude? What's dropping nudes? What's going on now? What's dropping? What's happening with me? She's like half naked. Oh, Mrs. Jones. Mrs. Jones. Mrs. Jones. Mrs. Jones. Let me find it. Wow, man. That's strange. But I I think it's something soft, man. Because, I mean, she's married now. I don't think she'd drop like new. There we go. There it is. See there. Do you classify that as a nude? It's not an old picture. No. No, it's not. It's not, nah, that's not a nude, man. Come it's on. It's not a nude, ne? No nipple, no nothing. That's not a nude. Pulani, that's a nude. With a, with a, with a, a blonde hair, right? Yeah, yeah the nah, one. that's ah. not a nude. Mm. Pulani, remember Pulani, who rose to fame via nudes that mm. were leaked? Mm-mm. Pulani, that, okay. But that was a nude. That's not a nude. But as a husband, would you agree if she posted something like that? I mean, what am I to? Look, if she, look, if my wife says, I want to, I don't think, should post that without the husband's consent i would if she's gonna post that i would especially if she's always been a public figure and she still has an amazing so body. you would have no problem with i would that. yeah very but she's married dog no she's no, advertising no. your goods but it's their marriage not ours they've designed it the way they've designed it how do you know it's not an open marriage we well, don't know exactly because you get like kim kardashian let's think of kim's mm-hmm. yes look at kim bro. and she was married you know because so. my first thing as a ninja, I'm asking is there's stock there? Because she's advertising. Yeah, but she's not advertising the stock because it's not showing, right? We don't even see anything there. There's, there's no coochie inside. So what's the point no of nipple? the picture then? To get people talking like we're doing right now. Oh, and like, to remind hey, I'm people. Still alive. And I still have yes. a banging body. Oh, okay. right? I know in my a marriage, I, I, I wouldn't be able to post a picture like that. What if she's about to The arrangement drop- we have, I can't pick, post pictures Why like is that? that? What kind of no, arrangement husband, do you guys have? No, because he's just like, I don't want nobody seeing my goods. Do you know how many yeah. pictures he takes off yeah, me? Bro, and then it's like, cool this is not that. going up. Exactly. You know? Mr. So, Jones is happy with that, though. He is. Clearly, Mr. Jones doesn't mind. The wife showing a yeah, bit of breast, exactly. a bit of hip, yeah, a bit yeah. of, you know what I mean? Mr. Jones is happy. Who, who are we? Come, come keep up with the Joneses. You can't, <laughs> your wife can't post nudes. Let the Joneses post nudes. <laughs> you know, say, right, see, la, why, why? No nudes released. <laughs> Fuck, before we go, man, did you hear Mark Zuckerberg just launched a new Ray-Ban smart glasses? Hey. What do they do? So basically, it's like your phone, but in glasses. So you can take pictures, upload. Take a call. So when you say Ray Ban, are they also 
with the company Ray-Ban. Yeah, yeah, they partnered oh, with Ray-Ban. Cool. So cool. it's basically like social media, but on your glasses. Ooh. And no one can poke you, right? <laughs> <laughs> Mark Zuckerberg stunts. <laughs> nah, oh, that's so dope. Ray-Ban story sunglasses can take photograph, uh, photographs and videos of whatever the wearer is seeing. Wow. Ooh. As well as play music and make phone calls with uh, sound emitted through tiny hidden speakers. <gasps> wow. That is so See, cool. We'll live in the future, man. <laughs> Mm, I'm not cheating. too sure I want that, bro. It sounds like some Black Mirror shit, dog. Have you watched Black Mirror? It. I haven't seen Black You gotta Mirror. watch Black Mirror, I'm man. Still on Squid Games. Yeah, you must watch Black Mirror. They, Aren't you they done? speak about this. No, I haven't. I'm, I'm saving the rest to check them out on, or like when we're flying to, to Ghana. Oh, yeah. Because oh. I'm restless. I can't sleep on planes. So I really need to like watch something. Yeah. So I'll just watch Squid Games. I don't know if I'm for it, man. I think. Yeah, me, the, my only paranoia about that is because, I mean, we. On Facebook, you search. You were searching something on Google, and then adverts of that thing start appearing on Facebook. So mm. we're always watched. So now with that, and even our cameras, you know, when you say Facebook, allow Facebook to use your phone camera, you say yes, and they can tap into it whenever. Yeah. yeah. Right. When I'm in this room, they can see what I'm viewing. Mm. Yeah. Right now, they'll just see. But you know what I mean. They have to so, hack into it, obviously. But yeah, they don't they hack into, they you, don't. into it. Is when it you say allow, allow, allow. to use oh. mic. Allow camera, allow speaker. Facebook can listen. Even when Facebook is off, it's still running in the background. Exactly. They can use your mic and your speakers to listen to to to, to whatever is in the room. So That's why you can I guess the Jones don't mind that. Uh, <laughs> always allow what? <laughs> <laughs> so my paranoia my paranoia is someone viewing whatever I'm seeing at any given moment. So no thank you. Yeah. Nah. But you used the glasses, so it wouldn't make. A oh difference. yeah, I don't wear sunglasses because I need these things on at all times. Yeah. yeah. Are you for it, ghost lady? I feel like it's the same with how we already have phones. Mm. Like recording, you know, we can record, we can take videos. But just now, it just you can you are able to use your glasses. Yeah, I think I'm it's just for the, the same. future, man. The future is looking crazy. The future is looking nuts. Uh, mm. Big shout out to our new Miss Yeah. Shout out, shout out. La Lela Mswane. Beautiful. Well yeah. done, La Lela. Yeah. Have you even seen her? I, cool, yeah, I saw it trending. I saw her pictures. Yeah. Mm. Miss SA. Miss SA. Miss SA. Like, yeah. But it was nice. There, was, there, were, there were three black ladies in the top three. That was dope. Mm. Yeah, 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 yeah. That was beautiful. She actually started Bachelor of Law at Tux. Oh, wow. Yeah, she qualified. And she's oh, a wow. ballerina. 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 Wow. Mom's talented. Have you ever, have you ever I like dated that. a ballerina? Hmm? Have you ever dated a ballerina? No, I, I like thick girls. Yeah, so likes thick girls. I like, I like. What thick are you girls. trying to say about thick girls? I like. I curves. don't do ballet. No, I like. No, come on, let's be honest. The typical ballerina, <laughs> the typical ballerina is skinny. No, the typical <gasps> ballerina. I like my woman curvy. Yeah. Right, curvy. Mm. Like curvy and unable to stand on her toes. Are you oh. trying to say that? I keep her on her toes. Damn. Oh. Wait, you're not in Corabella mode. <laughs> yeah, that's every day, basically. <laughs> oh, shit, man. Do you guys still even watch Miss AC? Did anyone uh, watch it? I always miss it. Yeah. I caught the, in, the, the, the last part of it last night. As yeah. a female, you should be watching that, man. No, I'm so over it, to be honest. I'm so over it. Yeah. Like, you know, it's cute when you're still young and just expiring. <laughs> like, you aspire to be a Miss South Africa one day until you grow up and realize I don't meet the criteria, I don't have the height, I don't have the figure, I don't, then it's like... Because my woman is the most beautiful woman I've ever met. Exactly. And she's not on that stage. And oh, why? Shit, why? That's the Coravella talking. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> she just added the portion right now. <laughs> and I ate before I came here. <laughs> and I ate pop. Oh. Hey, hey it's, it's sitting in there. Oh. <laughs> it's doing its work. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> we need a Coravella vaccine, guys. <laughs> Some antibodies. <laughs> oh, Coravella vaccine. <laughs> now that's what uh, we I'll need right get now. That right away. <laughs> Sign me up for the jab. Uh, but we actually shot with Anele, who was hosting Miss S. Yes, yes. Oh, yes. we interviewed her last week. What a star. Oh, man. man. We went out to Cape Town just for Anele. I saw yeah, that, man. Guys. Yeah, it was dope, but it took a while because we were recording, like, not on the stage, but behind the stage. Yeah. Because uh, we're looking for the in front of the stage, yeah, yeah, in front of the stage. Okay. So they were busy working. So it took like six hours before we started recording. We started like a ten, right? Yeah. No, started at eight, finished at ten. Mm. And I'm thinking she's she's gonna be like a 
you know, celebrity and be like, nah, I don't want to do this anymore. Oof, you know, not even, like eh? she was so chill. She was so chill. Yeah. What a food, with yeah. the nice man. You know yeah. what I mean? We were drinking with her. Yeah, yeah it was easy, relaxed oh, nice. person. Yeah. yeah. Oh, I can't wait for you guys to check it out, man. It's amazing. Oh, she's oh, funny. Nice. Nah, she's she super is. Funny. No, she is. She's good. She's no, Anneli is funny. She's she's, she's a funny one. Yeah. Anyway, anything else that I'm leaving out? No, they shot Max. Who? What oh, Max? Max from Kati. You love. They shot Max, and now he was in his car, right on the phone, mm. and they shot him, but fortunately he didn't die. And he, he drove managed himself. to make yeah. it to the hospital, and later on, when they picked his phone up, the bullet, bullet. was stuck in the phone. They were literally went for the headshot. Bullet stuck in the phone, saved by the iPhone Pro. Mm. Max. <laughs> yeah, dog. But I think, for real. But fortunately, he's still alive. He's good. He's good. Yeah. I heard they're gonna make a documentary about the whole thing and put it up on one of the streaming platforms because the shooters were trying to show Max. <laughs> oh man, Dude, crazy that's though. crazy. On a serious note, that is fucking nuts. Ooh, nuts. But the whole club scene is an underworld. Oh, 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 club scene is something. I mean, how many club guys, security guys, get killed in Cape Town? Sure. You know, when they fight over those things, kind of things, because we don't know what other dealings those guys have. And mm. also, besides the club thing, the guy's got gang load of money. He's probably invested in other businesses. And you know how it is, bro. Being a I remember when I had a, a club at Paparazzi. Mm -hmm. uh, I didn't know this was a thing in the clubbing thing. Yeah. But they would come and put Muti on the door so no one would come in. Mm. Mo no, <laughs> but usually they put Muti to bring in the people. No, no they'd put Muti so the other club owners. So we'd have nights where we were clapping so everybody. So put you on mute. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <Fuck it now. laughs> on mute. <laughs> like mute. Oh, mute is working. Now. Yeah. <laughs> the mute. <laughs> I remember we, we booked black coffee once, for example. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And the place was. I was there for the black coffee. Yeah, I you understand? Remember, but I was there. So they started saying, hey, this this club is coming with fire. Oh. Mm -hmm. So then they put Muti so that people, when they come in, they're like, ah, let's go somewhere else. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, that's why they say there are also people who have got businesses, they actually put their own Muti. To make sure. Yes, definitely. You know? Especially in KZN. I mean, KZN, you ah, know. It's everywhere. Like, huh? Eh? Ah, but like, KZN, KZN, you see me, my dad is, is from KZN, right? Okay. And every time I tell people, they're like, I'm like, my dad is from Nguavum. They're like, oh. yo, deep there, the mood there is crazy. <laughs> you know what I mean? And my dad doesn't even believe in those things. Uh -huh. But like, Muti, the practicing of Muti, we know, you know what I mean? It's prevalent in some parts, all over the country, in fact. Yeah. It's just that there's some parts where you've got the stronger ones, Yeah. you know? And of course, if you're a smart businessman or a taxi owner, we all know, you use Muti to protect yourself and your establishment. Mm. You don't try to use it to fuck up other people, mm. but then then we get into the realm of Uktarat. That's when people try to fuck you up with Muti. And then I'd book Shimza and it was empty and I'd be like, hey, Shimza's pop. Ah. You know, because I didn't know. You didn't know. And it was it, not it was, Shimza. It, it was, was the Muti. Your neighbors putting Muti yeah. or, or fellow club owners yeah. bringing down. So what kind of Muti were they, were they putting? What I kind don't of know, man. They just told me that they put Muti in the in in the front <coughs> so people wouldn't come in. And this is in Katlerong, right? Katlerong Springs. Ah. Yeah, yeah. So it was just stormy seasons in your club. <laughs> <laughs> there, there was always a hurricane. <laughs> If you're from Katsu Hong, you know what I'm talking yeah, about. Yeah, if you know, you know. If you know, you know, dog. Hurricane. If you know, you know, dog. And not, not the Tottenham hurricane. You know? <laughs> Anything else I'm leaving out, Ghost Lady? Actually, when So was talking about um, GBV, the space you listened to, took me to um, SK. Yeah. Moza. So now his ex fiance is alleging that he has been violent and it's gone to the um, extent S of physical. Mm. SK Koza. Allegedly. SK Koza, SK Koza when you say ex, you mean baby mama? The yeah. colored lady? Yo. The one that was let's Google, but it's the ex. Yeah. The ex fiance Yo. even. Yo. Yo. Yo, guys. It's a rap. So, Yo, it's a, Shaga. Hey, that's it's bad. A rap. It's Shaga, right? His character. Mm. Yeah, he was Shaga on the queen. Yo, shucks. SK Koza uh, case. What should I Google? It's called GBV. Okay, GBV, SK Koza. Arrested for GBV. Yeah, even arrested, guys. <sighs> How hectic. Uh, what? Uh, the article say what? Happened today. 
Like, why do we still have to go through such things? SK Kosa says he wants to be a better man. The star opened up about some of the issues he has uh, realized he needs to fix for the sake of his relationship with fiance. This is July, 28th July. That's old, man. Yeah, that's mm. old. That's not that one. Mm. The yeah. GBV arrest was now. Yeah, oh, this was oh, now. allegations. Allegations. Oh, they are now. They are now. Yo, hold me. Yo. Hey, hey, hey. SK, according to one shocking report in South Africa, sometimes known as the destination of femicide more than 2700 women have been murdered as a result of gender-based violence since the year 2000 um, mm-hmm. one would assume that such crimes are only committed by ordinary members of the community even well-known personalities have been linked with, to such offenses right. on sunday morning one of south africa's leading publications have since broken the news that the queen star mm-hmm. stembi so sk Koza, has been arrested for allegedly beating up his girlfriend ayanda Songwane, in a domestic violence incident mm-hmm. in northern joburg mm. that's sad to hear so, man. so now this is not even like old stuff it's like yeah. the current girlfriend this is current. yeah oh. three hours ago yeah, yeah. oh no Take, man. Man. Sure. This is not a good look. On a lighter note, big shout out to Moonchild, man. What? What's going uh, on? The song is on FIFA 22. Ooh. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I saw that like a few weeks ago. Yeah. Wow. Shout out, Moonchild. Yeah. Yeah. Kicking. Wow, kicking ass. Oh. <laughs> what? No. Shout out, Moonchild. FIFA, that's big. Yeah, bro. that's massive. Nice. Wow, big. dope. But you know, Moonchild is always making strides like these, bro. Oh, Moonchild, yeah. I mean, that's her lane, bro. Yeah. I mean, she's always getting the bag. All right, it's time to make some announcements. Yes, Friends of Amstel is back on the 4th of December. Oh, yeah. Featuring international superstar Wizkid. Hey, sh- and remember last week we asked you to choose uh, your favorite local pair that yes. you'd like to see on stage. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Congratulations to uh, King Sutu underscore RSA on Instagram for choosing uh, Deben Gogo and Kamun Pella. Oh, nice. What the? King Sutu! Yes. Yeah, boy. Six pack of Amstel is coming your way. Mm. And now that uh, Deben Gogo and Kamun Pella have been removed, yeah. people have to choose for another local pair. Oh. Okay, but not with those names. Yes. Ah. yes. So I can say Focalistic and, and Mr. Jazzik, for example. Ah, ah, mm-hmm. Awesome. Yeah. Yes. 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 So here's the lineup once again. It's Focalistic, Mr. Jazzik, Oscar Mbo, DJ Stokies, Java, Big Zulu, Banks, Venom, La Soul, The Capo, La Mise, and lastly, Lula Cafe. So head on out to social media and let us know the pair of local artists that you want to see together on stage. Just tag at Podcast with Mad G and use the hashtag Friends of Amstel SA. That's Friends of Amstel SA. And stand a chance of winning a six-pack of Amstel next week. Otherwise, tickets are limited and they can only be purchased uh, by buying an Amstel. So if you want to secure yourself a seat to come through and join us on the 4th of December, get yourself an Amstel, dial star 120 star 132 hash and uh, follow the... uh, uh, instructions Yes the, the yeah. Instructions On yeah. the USSD Yes That's how yeah. it is man So get ready for a timeless experience With friends of Amstel Featuring Wizkid 4th of December Not to be missed Ooh. Can't wait man Every mm. time I say The the the, the, the oh. thing is happening Like And we're getting closer and closer bro. Closer and closer bro I can't wait I mean he's one of the biggest guys With the biggest song out now So yes. Are you going to be in VIP Or are you going to be with the peoples On the day of the event Both both. Oh. Both. If I can't, like, you know. So you got a VIP ticket? Obviously. Oh, okay. I mean, obviously. Oh, okay. Oh. <laughs> who, who is us and who are we? <laughs> what do you mean? Do you have VIP tickets so or do I? So you definitely should exercise Obviously, yeah, I powers. should. But I'll be, I'll, I'll be both, you know. Yeah. I'll, be, I'll be on both sides, definitely. All right, cool. Also, 6th of November, it's my birthday party, man. Oh, yeah. uh, looking forward to it. Make sure you get your tickets on DigiTicket right now. Uh-huh. 6th November is going down. I'm finding it so hard to book. I'm a piano artist, dog. Ooh. Why? You, I don't know what's happening with those guys, bro. They're I mean, another you're not world. booking them for an interview. Tell yeah. them it's not an interview. <laughs> Maybe they think it's an interview after what happened with Bukhe. Yeah. Of which we didn't do anything wrong. Yeah. She didn't too. She just told the truth. Why though? And you know what's crazy about Bootle? I was speaking crazy? to her during the week, like maybe two weeks ago. Yeah. And she's now getting more gigs than Danko. before. Nice. Danko. Nice. I couldn't even get her for my birthday because I tried to book her and she's got two gigs in Limpopo that night. Ooh, mm. Danko. I tried Lady Do. She's also got two gigs. Black Motion as well. Yeah. But yeah, I'm waiting on the other guys to come back. Angelic? Uh, Angelic said he'll get back to me. Dango. Yeah. Nah, man. Yeah. Well, but you can't blame them. I mean, it's my piano, dog. And they you fucking know? shit up, exactly. bro. Exactly. So, and it's December. Mm. Is it December? 
Well, it's clear, almost. It's almost. almost. Yeah. It's a silly season. Yeah. It's a silly season, bro. So those guys are in demand. Yeah. Uh, something that's also in demand is grandeur. Oh. You can now get it at uh, Kofi in Pulukwani oh, and nice. Kofi in Centurion. Ah, uh, the Kofis. Yes. The Kofis. Dope. yes. Nice Other than one. that, if you want to support the channel, make sure you check out our Patreon page. We actually uploaded a CC interview that we did for our Patreons and members. Oh, oh CC. Nice. Yes. yes. So C-C-C. if you're a big fan of CC, make sure you become a Patreon so you can check out that episode. Dope. And let us know what you think. And also there's some cool stuff coming up in Patreon. So yeah. Oh, yeah. If you just want to support as well, uh, make sure you become a Patreon. Am I leaving anything out? Nah, I think you got everything covered. Yeah. We out here. Podcast and chill. Boom. Boom. What's happening? Thank you so much, Chillers, for the continued support. Always remember, make sure you subscribe and you like. And also, if you like, you can become a subscriber. And yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Yo, what is happening? Shout out for your continued support on Podcast and Chill. Make sure you subscribe and like. They subscribe and they like. Right? <laughs> oh, that one. All right. Yo, what's happening? Shout out to. Nah, fuck. Let's go again. Uh, paint me there, nah. To paint me. Yo, what is happening? Shout out. Thank you guys so much for the support. And always remember to subscribe and like. And you can also become a member and subscribe to Patreon and, you know, throw the, the coins a bit. All right. Peace. Love you all so much. Last one? Yeah. Yo! Thank you guys so much for your fucking continued support. Please remember to subscribe, like, and do all those things. Become a member, a patron if you want to bless us a bit and, you know, throw the coins that make them dance on the podcast. Peace. Love you so much. <laughs> <laughs>